Firstly, the base default ruling when it comes to buying and selling and transactions, is it that the asal is it is permitted and allowed or is the asal that it is haram? For example, the, the management of the masjid, outside the masjid or in the canteen area, they are selling books. And this one says it's haram to do so. How can you sell to students? And these are students of knowledge and you're selling books to them. And the other one will say, no, it's halal. So which one of the two statements is So which one of the two views is correct? And the correct view is that the asal, the base ruling or the default ruling when it comes to buying and selling is that everything is halal. Unless there is a specific evidence which makes it haram. So that brother who was saying that no, it's not allowed and it's haram. You say to him, give me your evidence. But you ask him not in a rude manner. Rather, you ask him politely that explain the ruling to me. Explain the evidence to me. What's the evidence for this? And if the evidence is clear, then I'll return back from my error. And Sheikh Ibrahim in his supermarket, he buys and sells. He sells he spell, he sells food stuff and he sells planes, sells cars, he sells metals and, and wood and computers, he sells mobiles. So the base ruling of selling these matters and anything else is that it is permitted. And, and Sheikh Ibrahim says that nobody is allowed to tell me that something is haram for me to sell in my supermarket, supermarket except if there's an evidence which makes it haram. And this is the base ruling in Islam.